in Canberra's north. SIDS and Kids ACT has set up a safe sleeping nursery in Gugong, the first of its kind in Australia. The room is set up ahead of Red Nose Day tomorrow to raise awareness and educate parents on safe sleeping for their babies. Like most babies, little Lachlan is a bit wriggly, so it's important when he goes to bed he's tucked in on his back. Unlike adults, there are many dangers for babies when they sleep. The cot needs to be made up so that the baby goes into the cot with its feet to the foot of the cot. This is to avoid the danger of the baby wriggling down underneath bedclothes and, and suffocating. Around 50 babies die each year from unknown causes when they sleep. That number was 500 when SIDS and Kids began 26 years ago. The organisation is still educating parents on what to avoid. The cot also needs to be made up with no soft and puffy bedding in it, so not using doonas or or pillows or cot bumpers, so things that have the potential to suffocate the baby. A safe sleep nursery has been set up in a display home in Gugong to show parents the correct way to put their baby to bed. Part of our work is to actually try and minimise fatal sleeping accidents by providing education on how to put your baby to bed in a way that's safe. So when people come and look at the house, they can see how they should be putting their baby to bed when they have the nursery set up. The safe sleep display will be open to the public at the Gugong Display Village every day for the next six weeks. Rochelle Widowson, Win News.